Welcome back to my channel. It's Kat here. For today's video, it's going to be a makeup tutorial using Ofra X Francesca Tolle collaboration, which is called Infinite Collection. For those who aren't familiar with Francesca Tolle, she is an Italian makeup artist with every A-list celebrity, including Beyonce, Tusher, Cindy Crawford, and her work featured in print and TV for decades. I'm just going to start with my eyes first. I already done my brows off camera, but first I'm just going to show you the Infinite Palette Packaging. Mm, ganda, diba? So at the back, you'll see the information, how to use ingredients, tapos yung pangalan ng shades ng eyeshadow palette. So, ito siya. So it comes with a box. Yan. With offer logos. So here is the Infinite Eyeshadow Palette of Francesca Tollot. I'm just going to show you guys how thick this palette is. Okay, so I'm just going to show you what's inside. Kaya pala siya medyo mabigat, guys, or may weight, kasi magnetic yung case niya. And so these are the shades of the Infinite palette. So we have bright and neutral zones, warm to cool zones, and we have matte and shimmer. So yeah. Also, the shade pans are removable, so as you can see. Pero hindi ko pa siyang tatry tanggalin. So, it also has a large mirror. So, hindi ko pa natatanggal yung protector. Kaya, ganyan yung itsura. For my eyeshadow base, I'm going to use this No Beauty Concealing Me Softly in the shade beige. I'm just cleaning up my brows na din. And to blend it, I'm going to use the concealer buffer brush. So first, I'm going to start with this shade called Venus, which is a bright magenta. And it's a matte shade. And I'm going to use a small pencil brush. I'm just going to take this blending brush. So next, I'm going to take this shade Mood. It's a mauve plum satin eyeshadow. I'm just tilting my head back. Kasi para makita ko yung face ko. Kasi malik na yung lids. Take a petite crease brush and I'm just going to blend the shade Mood. Para hindi harsh yung lines. The next shade I'm going to use is this matte black shade which is called Oscuro and I'm going to use the same brush then my crease on lang light stroke yeah In my crease, I'm going to use this shade which is called Chartreuse. It's a lime green with gold flakes and I'm going to use my flat blending brush. So, medyo nakakulang to sa pigment niya. So, I'm going to try to use this Lay All Day Setting Spray by Jared Cosmetics and just going to sprint on my brush. Konti lang. Same color now. Back to the palette, and I'm just going to take the shade mood and I'm just going to apply it on my outer V. So, face muna tayo mamaya ka babalik ang yung eyes. So, first is moisturizer. So, I'm going to try this Nivea Soft Refreshingly Soft Moisturizing Cream. 
Tignan natin kung okay ba siya for oily skin. Testing natin today. So for primer, I'm going to use my current favorite. This is the Moonshot Multi Protection UV Fixer. If you've watched my um, trying out Korean makeup look, yan, gusto gusto ko tong product na to. Ito talaga yung ginagamit kong primer recently pag lumalabas ako. Kasi ang ganda niya talaga. By the way guys, may bagong mic ako. Kaya baka napapansin nyo medyo mas clear or hindi masyadong ay may tak 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 ganun kayo mga ririnig. Kasi ang gamit ko lang yung earphone ko. <laughs> Sinasabit ko lang sa damit ko or gumagamit ako ng sipit para gawing lapel mic. <laughs> diba? So, for foundation, I'm going to use L'Oreal True Match. This is in the shade N5. Per usually, shade ko is N7, pero ubus na. Hindi ako gagamit ng corrector ngayon kasi, again, for video purposes lang. So, I'm going to blend it using my Beauty Blender. Thank you again, Beauty Blender Philippines. I'm going to sprint some setting spray. Or you can use water if you want. Honestly, you guys, this is my first time using the OG Beauty Blender. Usually, mga ginagamit ko kasi mga mamumurahin lang or mga drugstore sponges. So, I compared the two. Like, yung OG tapos yung mga drugstore brands, yung mga replica or something. Um, pansin ko, yung texture niya to, very different siya sa mga nagamit kong sponge. Yung mga sponge kasi meron ako is LA Girl, uh, Nichido, Eco tools, as yung iba bigay lang sa akin. Pero, nothing compared to the original. I'm going to take more of the foundation. I'm just going to apply it under my eye. Ayoko siyang i brighten up masyado. So. For beacon, I'm going to use my favorite Nichido Final Powder in the shade Ivory Glow. As you can see, konti na lang siya. So, I'm not going to use a sponge, pero gagamit ako ng puff. Yeah. Powder puff. Kasi I found it very helpful than sponge. In my opinion lang na. Okay, so for bronzer, I'm going to use the Illuminate by Ashley Teasdale. Namiss ko tong palette na to. So, I'm going to take a synthetic blending brush. Just going to apply it on my forehead. I'm going to bronze up my nose. I don't want to use nose contour. But for my clients, I have a nose contour. But for myself, I don't feel like it's not bad for me. I don't want to. But, I'm going to practice. Oh, I'm going to get the technique. That's it. I'm going back to the palette and do the same thing what I did on the crease under my eye. To use a clean flat brush. I'm going to take this shade, which is called Senke, and I'm just going to apply it on my brow bone. For blush, I'm going to use this Ofra 3D Pyramid Blush, and I'm just taking this three shades right here. So I'm going to apply 10K. Just going to apply it on my cheekbone. So for lashes, I'm going to use this Mundas lash line in the style Adele. I'm going to line my lips using this Michido lip pencil in the shade Coral Rust. So first, I'm going to show you the Francesca Tallet Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. This is in the shade Vermilion. It's a vibrant red.
is the vermilion shade to be honest with you guys i don't like the shade i was expecting to have a vibrant red yung parang uh, mac cosmetics na ruby woo but kind of disappointing your shade okay, so i'm not sure if this is a matte finish pero sa ngayon nakikita ko hindi siya matte And it's the end of this video. If you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to click thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and click the notification bell button so you get notified every time I upload a new video. I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye!